Hello, everyone. Welcome to CryptoCast, your source for all things cryptid related, unknown, and paranormal. I'm your host, Parker, and welcome back to a very special episode of CryptoCast today. Also, before we get into today's video, I want to ask you guys, stay tuned to the very end of this video right here, because I have a very special announcement for you guys at the end of this video, so please stick around for that. Um, but... Today we're going to be doing something very different on this channel, something I've never done, something I thought would be a cool idea for this channel. Um, we're going to be taking a look, a little dive into the haunted side of eBay. Now, if you go on eBay, type in haunted, you'll get a lot of haunted mansion stuff, but you'll also get a lot of people selling allegedly haunted items on eBay that they don't want anymore. So, we're going to be taking a little deep dive into that. I looked some stuff up on there, got a few, got 13 different ones that I want to show you guys, and we're going to talk about them a bit. And I think this is going to be fun, so if you guys are excited for this, hit a like on this video, and I'll get these up on the screen for you. So, let's see. First thing. So when you go on there and you type in haunted on on eBay, this is the first thing that you will see. Um, a metaphysical haunted satanic ring black magic no haunted doll power eight. Um, I'm not sure what the power eight means, honestly, truthfully. I don't really know about the powers, but um let me actually move this down a bit, but the, or up, I don't know. But, um, I'm really not going to like harp on this one too much just because this is some, somebody made this ring. Um, and I don't want to like offend anybody, do their, like, uh, mock anybody's religion or anything, but I just thought this was kind of interesting. I've never kind of seen anything like this before on, on eBay. I looked at haunted eBay like a long, long time ago and it was so different, but now it's, um, it's changed quite a bit. People are like selling their item, like different items that they enchanted themselves. Um, and this is one of those examples right here. And I just thought that was interesting. And I just wanted to show that off to you guys. Um, next up, um, we got some more, I think, yep, this is another enchanted one. This one's a little bit different. Uh, we got a handmade resin bubble pendant haunted spirit bound female Phoenix of light. Um, so that is a lot in the title, but, um, again, I'm not going to like harp on this a lot because this, somebody created this one. This is what somebody believes in. Um, again, I just thought this one was really, really interesting. Um, I really like, again, like with the ring, I've never really like haunted eBay's changed a lot since I looked at it like a few years back. Um, like I said, I was a lot of people enchanting stuff and, um, selling that on eBay, and this is another one of those examples. I just thought this was kind of unique, and I don't know. I've just, like, I'm not sure. I don't know. It, it's just really unique, and I thought I would show that off in this video. Um, so let's go on to our third one. This one's kind of funny. Haunted Thomas the Train, no doll, plays on its own. Now, when I was younger, let's, let's this is a story time with with Parker here. When I was younger, Thomas the Train scared the ever living shit out of me just because the faces like didn't move, um, and they were human faces on trains. It was just really creepy. So if I was younger and I had this and started playing on its own, this would scare the shit out of me. But I just think it's kind of funny now because it's just Thomas the Train, a haunted Thomas the Train, something relatively newer. But I don't know. I think that's kind of funny. But Haunted Thomas the Train. Next up on the list, we have this right here. This one's really cool. A doorknob from Athens Lunatic Asylum. No Haunted Doll Dybbuk. Um, so the reason I think the titles are really loaded for some of these is because they want to show up in like as many search results can. So like people looking up Dybbuk boxes, they will also get the doorknob. People typing in Haunted Doll, they'll also get the doorknob. But this is actually from Athens Lunatic Asylum, um, if we're to be believed by the listing. So that is a very, very cool. I legit think this is a very cool haunt. And I am definitely probably has a lot of energy on it. I, I think it's cool. 
So that is that doorknob, and like I said, I think that's super, super cool. Uh, let's see. We have this here. A Haunted Lover Succubus Incubus Sexual Magic Bracelet Paranormal Gin. Again, I'm not going to harp on this too much because somebody believes in this. Somebody made this, and um, I, I've just never seen anything like it. So, again, this is just another example. Um, I just kind of wanted to show you, like I said, Haunted eBay's changed a lot since I last looked at it. And this is just another one of those kind of examples about how it's changed a lot. People selling their enchanted stuff that they made themselves on on eBay, and I think that's really, really kind of cool um, in its own way. Next up, guys, we got a, let's see. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Here we go. Here's a haunted doll. Um, we got haunted dolls, active spirit, paranormal, Amanda. So there are a lot of haunted dolls on eBay, and I mean like a lot of haunted dolls. Um, they also have like a lot of voodoo stuff on there as well that people can purchase. They have, um, like I said, the people enchanting their own items and selling them on eBay and um, just haunted dolls in general. And this one seems really cool. This one stood out to me for some reason, but um, I can, it's kind of, I don't know if that's an older doll or not, but there definitely could be some energy on it. Um, but if I were to buy something off of eBay that was haunted, I, I really wouldn't want it to be a doll. I, I like, dolls are okay, they're just, I don't want that thing, like, moving in the middle of the night and, like, watching. I That would freak me out. So, um, I had to have a haunted doll in there. Next up, we have this. Um, haunted folk dolls, highly active metaphysical vessel doll. Um, do Not Clown. I almost skipped over this one, but then I just saw the Do Not Clown in the title and thought that was kind of funny. I had to include it, but um, these dolls, though, they look at those, though. Those are definitely old. They definitely have seen some use over the years, and yeah, no, I would not be surprised if those would be haunted. Those are very kind of... They're, they're a little scary, in my opinion. <laughs> But do not clown in all caps. Just that's what kind of that's what kind of got me. Um, here we go. Haunted antique teddy bear doll. Cora active tangible doll. So apparently there's a spirit named Cora living inside this little teddy bear right here. It's an antique teddy bear. Um, very kind of different, very unique, and um, you really don't see a lot of haunted stuffed animals on eBay. It's mostly dolls. So there's a stuffed pig on there as well. There's a haunted piggy bank as well. Just thought this was kind of different and I wanted to show that off. Thought that was kind of... I thought it was kind of cool. I thought that was kind of cool. So I, I I definitely wanted to show that off a bit. We got... Haunted Dolls Paranormal Act Active Spirit Doll Facial Expressions Change. And... This looks like an old man kind of like puppet or statue of some kind. And they see the facial expressions change on him. Um, that is something that's very creepy to me. If I saw the facial expressions change on like any of my, like any of my toys when I was younger that aren't supposed to change their facial expressions. Um, like, let's see, let me get an example here. I have just some off to the side. Um, like, here, let me shrink this down. Like, if Hoops' face, just expression just changed on me, like, to, like, a scowl or a frown or something, that would scare the shit out of me when I was younger. So, that is, that's creepy. But also very cool at the same time. A lot of these things I'm showing, I'm just interested. They're, they look really cool, they look different, and I just thought they would be cool to include in the video. Um, next, we have, we have to have a Dybbuk box in the video. Um... Dybbuk boxes that people sell on eBay and on the dark web. Um, I, I watched this one video and a lot of people just make these themselves. And um, apparently like a lot, like from the video that I saw, it's kind of disrespectful to the Jewish community and everything. So I've just, um, I do not advise buying a Dybbuk box 
off online um, if you want to. I cannot stop you, but I just kind of, I don't know. I just, it, just for me personally, I just feel, I would just feel uncomfy buying a debit box online um, from eBay or something, just, um, just for those reasons alone. But I have a debit box in the video just, just cause it's a, just to kind of show you what you can find on there. Um, Dybbuk Box, Active Evil, Scary Haunted, Paranormal, Creepy Haunted, Rare Demon. Um, again, yes, these titles are very, very loaded. Next up on the list, let's see. We have this one. This one was kind of funny. I wanted to show this one off a bit as well. Alf Spirit Doll, Haunted Vessel, and Active Hide and Seek Sketchy Old Wise Quiet. Now, that means a lot of things. <laughs> that's a lot of things. So, for the active hide-and-seek thing, that's what I was... The thing that I was thinking was somebody used it for one-man hide-and-seek, which, um... You stuff a doll full of rice, um, soak it in the bathtub with salt water and stuff, tie a red string in, on its back, and then stab it, and, it ha and then the doll supposedly comes to life and hunts you down. So that might be what this is here. I'm not sure, but six people bid on it and 41 bucks. It's at 41 bucks right now. So the price definitely went up since the last time I've seen it, but this is unusual and I thought I'd show it off. Very cool. I used to love Elf back in the day when I was younger. Elf is cool. Um, now we have... Um, so we have a haunted spelled clown statue doll, many spirit guides, powers, very active helps. So this is another example here. People aren't just enchanting their jewelry and stuff. They're also enchanting like little statues and figurines as well, like this clown here. Um, wanted to show that off. Thought that was very kind of unique as well compared to the jewelry and stuff. But very cool nonetheless. People are like something like sort of like positively enchanted and charged. Um things on ebay which is very very nice helps people out but um it's cool and we got one last item here vintage creep vintage very creepy and old antique santa haunted christmas decoration plush cursed um zero bids one day 19 hours left ten dollars plus five ele plus 11 10 shipping this is a very creepy santa honestly guys um Look at that right there. That is scary. That is actually nightmare fuel. But it's it's very cool nonetheless. And with that, that is the last item on the list. So if you guys like this video, be sure to like button. You can dislike it if you dislike it. And um, subscribe if you're new to the channel. Become a member of the Crypto Crew today, guys. And as I promised, we got that announcement. We got that announcement. Um, if this video gets 100 likes um share this with your friends share this with your family share this with your teachers at school share it with whoever but if this video gets 100 likes i will purchase one haunted item off of ebay have a special live stream unboxing it and reviewing it and uh, do a little investigation on it as well so if you guys want to see that again help me get this video to 100 likes and we will do that and also guys i wanted to say thank you so much for um, a few, couple of weeks ago, I just haven't gotten around to it just because work and stuff's been busy, but the channel recently hit over 400, 400 subscribers, guys, and um, I'm blown away by the support of this community. You guys are all really great, and I really, really appreciate each and every one of you. So I thank you guys so, so much. You guys are amazing, and I, I wouldn't be here without you, so thank you. I'm just glad there's so many people here that share in this um the share in the same kind of interest as me with like the cryptids and the paranormal and stuff so i thank you guys so so much but yes if this video gets 100 likes i will buy one haunted item off of ebay and we will review it and there's a lot of noise in the background my dog's whining my mom's sneezing so my god i apologize for all that background noise everybody seems to go berserk when i film videos for some reason so yep if, but again guys thank you all so much um demon days tomorrow and I will see you guys in the next video. I've been your host, Parker. You've been watching CryptoCast. Stay spooky, and I'll see you guys. Bye.